Banana, you are the best two people we know. Thank you for this absurdly awesome lunch. We love you guys, seriously. Aloha. We had a busy day today, surprisingly. First, we started off a little bored, as usual in quarantine, but then I quickly got very excited. You beat me in chess. We got groceries delivered. And then Chad came. Was that the order? It happened that quick, huh? Yeah. Yeah. So the people we bought the boat from are the most amazing and awesome people. And uh, they picked up our order at the marine store and our new outboard motor, which is really exciting. We filled up the water tank today. And so that was kind of a game changer because we have a real sink. We did another clean of the boat and got to some areas we didn't quite make it to the first time. We had some beers. We had a bunch of beers. And we got denatured alcohol for our stove, so we're gonna have a warm dinner tonight. Yeah, we can cook. We'll have coffee in the morning, so we'll have a hot beverage. We inflated our inflatable. We inflated our inflatable. Yeah, it ended up being a busy day. A good day. It's because it was not raining all day long. Mm. I almost said it was sunny, but that's not true. <laughs> wasn't sunny, but it wasn't raining. But the other game changer that they told us about is that we put this little tarp over our entryway. So it's a little bit of extra living space. Man, that tarp nice. was also a game changer. It's all the little things that add up. It's all very exciting. It's looking up. And tomorrow we get our Alaska COVID test. And our seat cushions. And our seat cushions. It's an exciting day. Yeah. Dry Strait, mostly bare at low water, it affords passage for small craft at high water between the head of Sumner Strait and the head of Frederick Sound. So that would be the more direct route from mm -hmm. Petersburg to Wrangell. It sounds pretty dry. We should probably just <laughs> go Wrangell Narrows. So that means we could do Petersburg to St. John Harbor like we originally planned. Yeah. 56 degrees. 26.39 yep. north. Okay. We're gonna get it all cleaned up. We're gonna get it all dried out. And we're gonna re caulk the bottom of the toilet so it stops leaking and making the boat smell like pee. We finally got fuel for our stove. Woohoo! Soupy noodle! It's day seven of quarantine. And it's still raining, and we still don't have our original test results after 10 days. Lab core sucks. We're eight days in Juno in quarantine. We finally got our negative results, so we're going for a much needed trail run. And there's some loud birds. Woohoo! Here we are, running on the Nugget Falls Trail. It feels so good to be able to move. what you're doing? I'm making docking lines. Nice. I've got 100 feet of rope and I cut it up into smaller pieces. The lighter doesn't work outside because it's too windy. Oh no. I am making a mount for our head tank because it's going into the bow and so because the tank is a square we need to kind of support it from underneath. So we're cutting up this piece so that we've got a, a nice little support for underneath it. Mikey's trying out the pee birth tonight. <laughs> oh, hello. Show us your pee birth. This is the pee birth. 
It's like a whole nother room. Here I am. Here's the Becasita. Hi. Here's the turtles. <laughs> I like our boat. The turtles were a big upgrade in comfiness and silliness factors. Big upgrade. Good night.